Ruski Ed here with a lesson about Santa Claus and Father Frost. Check out these sample sentences. Translate them if you can before the end of the intro song. Ruski Ed is here, and in case it's not completely clear, to learn to read in Russian, you must know lots of Russian words and where they go. First of all, Santa Claus in Russian is Santa Claus, and Father Frost, or Grandfather Frost, is Dead Moroz. For the most part, Dead Moroz is the Russian counterpart to Santa Claus, but Yes menuga atlichi mejdu nimi, which means there are many differences between them. The word of interest in this sentence is a form of atlichi, and atlichi means difference. In fact, there are a number of differences between Santa Claus and Father Frost. Difference number one. Adin koronasti a drogoi statni. It means one is stucky and the other is stately. First of all, koronasti means stucky or stumpy, and secondly, statni means graceful, shapely, stately, dignified, magnificent, splendid, and that sort of thing. Difference number two. O Santa Clausa ku dravaya baroda. It means Santa Claus has a curly beard. And o deda moroza delenaya i pramaya baroda. It means Father Frost has a long and straight beard. Of course, Baroda means beard, but the word of interest here is Kudravaya, which is a form of Kudravui, and Kudravui means curly. Difference number three. In the case of Father Frost, on vadit cheres vadnuyu dvir, it means he comes in through the front door. And in the case of Santa Claus, on vadit cheres kaminuyu trubu, it means he comes in through the chimney pipe. There are a couple interesting words here. First of all, vadnuyu is a form of vadnoi, which is an adjective meaning entrance. Of course, the noun meaning entrance is vad. Also of interest is the word kaminuyu, which is a form of kamini, which is an adjective meaning fireplace. And, of course, the noun meaning fireplace is kamin. Difference number four. O Santa Clausa Doratsky Kolokolchik. It means Santa Claus has a foolish handbell. And Fruki u Dieda Morosa Posach. It means Father Frost has a staff in hand. While Santa Claus clangs an annoying handbell, Father Frost carries a useful staff. At any rate, the word of interest here is Posach, and Posach means staff as in stick. By the way, Doratsky means foolish, stupid, weird, or odd. It can also be used as an intensifier similar to the English word blasted. There are actually quite a few more differences between the two Christmas characters discussed in this lesson, and a few of these are suggested in the following bonus sentences. U Dieda Moroza Tio Playa Shuba Do Piat. It means Father Frost has a warm, full-length fur coat. U Santa Clausa Remian Sa Prajkoi. It means Santa Claus has a belt with a buckle. Snegorochka Eta Venochka Dieda Moroza. It means the snow maid is the granddaughter of Father Frost. By the way, Rojdesfov Rosii Trajnuetia Senmovo Yanvarya. And Rajdesfov Rosii Trajnuyo Senmova Yanvarya both mean Christmas is celebrated in Russia on January 7th. The reason for the difference on the day that Christmas is celebrated has something to do with the Georgian calendar and the Julian calendar. But we won't get into any of that complicated historical stuff in this lesson. The focus words for this lesson include Alichi, which means difference, Statni, which means stately, Kudravaya, which means curly, Kamini, which means fireplace, and Posach, which means staff. Roskiat, signing out now. Das Vidanya!